Okay, welcome everyone to a uh, tutorial on how to download a auto greeter for uh, Zamdoc. Now, what you have to do: go to Tools in uh, one a room that you created. Okay, any room you could create a private room if you wish. Click Tools, click Auto Welcomer. Page comes up. And you'll have a little window in the bottom. You need to click the uh, little arrow that points up. Okay, now save as. Another window will pop up. Okay, now what you have to do, you have to navigate through this window, save as. Click on desktop. You don't want it on your download or anywhere else. You just you want it on your desktop. Okay, you, you could save it anywhere you want. You could I could save it in my external data hard drive but I'll do it right to the desktop save to the desktop that's the best way you're gonna find it easy okay if you save it to the desktop click save once you click save it's gonna give you this icon on yours that means it saved it and you have it on your desktop I'm not gonna save it I already have it so I'm gonna cancel mine minimize this window I'll minimize this window because I have it right here now I can open this app, the Auto Welcomer. Okay. Now there's a little window. It's a user account control. It's gonna say, "Do you want to allow this app for, uh, from a unknown publisher to make change to your device?" You have to click yes. You have no choice. Okay. So you have to accept it. Okay. Now you're gonna see this window now okay now what you have to do okay every time you do something you have to highlight this text here do not change anything in this text now first of all we got what we're gonna do we're gonna change the size this is the size one two three you have three choice three different size click on two you seen it there it changed it to a bigger size that's good so now we're gonna put it like you got the B the B is for make it bold. That means your text is gonna be thicker than normal. Okay, so there you go. Now I got it on bold. Now that means it's italic text. It means your text is gonna be on the side a little bit. Just watch. It's gonna go on the side. See, it's slanted a little bit. Okay, so now we have that. Now what I want to do, I want to put something at the end there. I'm just gonna put uh, now open, okay? Just something as simple enough, okay? Now open. You could put anything you want at the end of this, okay? Do not change anything else. Put your space and then, okay, add it. So now I want to put uh, something else that Zamtalk has. Those emojis. I just want to add one of the emoji, okay? I have to click this. I like. Do a copy and then you put your line there then you have to put a space because it's too close to the welcome so put a space so it looks a little bit nicer it's not going to be jam onto the the welcome on the e so usually you put a space now to put it in there you can't copy with this program you have to use your keyboard so control v okay that puts it in into this area so now I want to change a welcome just I just want to change a welcome I want to change a color okay I'll put I'll give a color to the welcome okay there's a color that I put I put blue okay now I want to change the now open I want to put that in another color okay I'll gonna choose uh, green Okay, now this is changing green. Okay, now what I want to do, I want to highlight it. Add to save message. Okay, so now now it's it's added in the save message. It's over here. Okay, if you remove this, you could remove this, delete, and then you could add it again. You're not gonna have this open. Now open. Okay, it's just gonna say. Uh, 
welcome room. It's just gonna have the room name. That's it. Okay, nothing else at the end. It, it's it's kind of nice if you have a short name for your room. Okay, click add to save. Now you see it doesn't have not now open. It doesn't have it. Okay, now I'm gonna choose this one. Select. Okay, it puts it in black again. So that means I have to switch it black. Like it's uh, this program is not completely done, I believe, but uh, it works. Now I'm gonna make it in blue, and then I'm gonna put this back in green. There you go. Okay, now it's been selected. Now what I want to do, I want to go to the room. Uh, okay. Now I'll close. I'll take uh, one Nick out. I'll take the owner out. Because I want to bring him in. Back in. Okay, now I want to click refresh. See one... The, the name of my room is there the PC mechanic and the computer help room it says computer help you whatever advice uh, for advice but anyways okay now I got it there now I have to select now I put it in the bottom here if you select it so now you're all set up now you go back and you put a check in enable auto welcomer now if I bring back my uh, owner uh, Dino dinosaur uh, it's gonna welcome him okay so there you go welcome with the wave Dinosaur 8 to PC Mechanic now open. So that's how you set up the order will comer for Zamtalk. So if you have any questions like uh, about this, I could talk you through. If you come in into the uh, computer help, like if you, I'll show you how you get to the computer help. Okay, let me see here. Oh, come on. What did I do here? Oh, I bring up the wrong, the wrong Nick. Okay, um, if you go to here, join room. Okay, you go to the uh, PC and technology under computer help and advice I'll be in there okay thank you very much for watching I hope that was helpful for new users on Zamp Talk. thank you very much if you have any questions just come in the room if you need a video to do something I'll try to make one that it's understandable for the new users on Zamtalk. So, thank you for watching and uh, enjoy Zamtalk. Okay, that's where that's why it's there for. Thank you very much. Goodbye. Okay,